In this video, we will demonstrate the fundamentals of masking blocks. This model uses a gain block and a constant block to solve the equation y is equal to mx plus b. The gain block and the constant block both have their own block parameter dialog boxes. To assign a value for the slope and the intercept in order to solve the equation, the dialog boxes for the gain block and the constant block must be edited. This process gets more time consuming as the complexity of the equation and the number of blocks increases. You can simplify the process of assigning values to block parameters by encapsulating the blocks in a mass subsystem. With a mass subsystem, you can hide the block structure inside a subsystem with a customized dialog box. You can use this dialog box to assign values to the block parameters underneath the mass subsystem block. Let's see how this works. To pass values from the mass dialog box to the underlying block parameter, you can either promote a block parameter to the mask or add an edit parameter. When you promote a block parameter to the mask, the parameter becomes accessible from the mask and you can provide values for it. For example, click promote and select the gain parameter to promote to the mask dialog box. Here the gain parameter represents the slope of the equation. Type slope in the prompt field and m in the name field. When you add an edit parameter to the mask, the edit parameter must reference the underlying block parameter. For example, click edit under parameters. Notice that an edit parameter is created in the dialog box section. Type intercept in the prompt field and b in the name field. The edit parameter represents the y intercept of the equation and must be referenced from the constant blocks parameter dialog box. Having the same variable name for a parameter in the mask editor and in the block parameter dialog box ensures that the edit parameters on the mask for the intercept corresponds to the constant block parameter. When you specify a value for slope and intercept in the mask dialog box and simulate the model, the value of slope is directly assigned to the promoted gain parameter. For the intercept, the value of the variable b is found by looking first in the mass workspace, then the model workspace, and then the base workspace. In this case, the value of the intercept b is found in the mass workspace of the subsystem block. You can also use mask initialization code to set a block parameter value under the mask. To summarize, you can pass values to the block parameters under the mask by three different ways. By promoting a parameter to the mask, by referencing the edit mask parameter in the block using its parameter name, by using mask initialization code to set parameters under the mask. For more information on how to create a mask dialog box, see the Create a Mask Parameters and Dialog video.